The Real Housewives of New Jersey is chock full of cattiness and diva antics. Amber Marchese was a new addition to the cast last season and was thrusted into the ring of fire. She gets in the zone with us today. Welcome, Amber. Hi, how are you? Good, good. So, obviously we know the Real Housewives franchise is full of catty ladies and, as we mentioned, <laughs> major drama so uh -huh. why did you decide to sign up um you know first of all if a, if a cha challenge is presented i will never ever say no to a challenge and it was exactly that a challenge i thought i knew it was going to be a fun ride i knew it was going to be a wild ride uh you know i didn't i don't think it set you know in that it was going to be so much drum filled and so yeah. difficult to go through um, I really blocked that part of it and had a really a tunnel vision of like this is the coolest thing in the world you know it really is and you know it was just way too easy for me like it just it wasn't like I tried hard it just the opportunity landed in my lap and yeah. I just I follow signs in life mm -hmm. and I just felt like this was a really good sign. So you went with your path mm -hmm. but your path led you to some really uncomfortable situations mm -hmm. and I think that I'm a big fan of the show I've watched it and you really had to defend your husband a lot of the time. I mean, yes. your hair was pulled from the uh -huh. twins, and then your husband, of course, tried to back you up, and then he really got the brunt <clears> of it. <throat> Do you regret having him a part of the show? Has it hurt his career in any way because he's yeah. a businessman? Uh, to answer that question, no, it did not hurt his business whatsoever. Um, actually, his business is doing very well, thank God. Mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm. um, as far as his uh, involvement, he did not want to be involved. In fact, he set out to be just the husband and supporting and loving father. It never works that way. And it shows. did not work out in like not even a little bit. It's like you know, it's and then you know, it, it's, he was starting to be a part of it, and then he's like, I can't be half pregnant, so I might as well just now I'm involved. Yeah. And then he just saw how. Every Everyone was really coming at me, mm -hmm. and he just could not sit by idle with not, without helping me. Mm -hmm. And he really did come to my defense, and he stood by my side a lot. What do you yeah. say to the cast members and also those blogging that you should leave your husband, that he's a loose cannon? You know, I think it's not fair that, like, everyone has an ally. You know, mm -hmm. the twins have each other. They have one another. You know, Teresa, Teresa and Melissa kind of made an agreement to, <laughs> you know, stay together and right. not fight anymore. Right you know good for them so everyone had an alliance who was my alliance I was really like coming in on my own and I had my husband that was my alliance and yeah. I had a really good alliance <laughs> <laughs> a really no, strong one Spartan warrior Teresa Giudici is uh -huh. going to jail in a matter of days um, yes you have had a nice friendly rapport with her have you spoken to her since the the sentencing um, well, I saw her at the reunion, and um, I do talk to her via text once in a while, and I just, I really just reach out just to say, hey, mm -hmm. how are you, just thinking of you, hoping you are okay, and everyone's mm -hmm. doing all right. She's doing what any mother would be doing. She's basically showing the world out and concentrating on her children, and right. I commend her for that. I mean, what else are you going to do? She's mm -hmm. doing what needs to be done. Mm -hmm. And... Of course, everybody wants to know, is there going to be another season of The Real Housewives of New Jersey? Because Teresa was the biggest star, the longest star that's been on that show. Mm -hmm. Can we expect to see it? You know, a lot of rumors, uh, a lot of talk, um, but nothing is set in stone. Nothing. I haven't even, even on my end, I haven't heard anything. So they're not keeping me in the loop, I think, um, by design. <laughs> and I'll just, you know, if, once I get that phone call, if they want me back, then we'll deal with it then. But until then, I just kind of live my life and I'm happy. Right. And speaking <laughs> of, of living your life, you are a breast cancer survivor yes. and now you have a new fitness line. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, I had a fitness line called Vici Fitness, which means to conquer. Uh, and, um, you know, whatever you're conquering, you know, having a new baby, you know, breast cancer, any type of disease, you could conquer it, get on to fitness. But then I found this other, this group um, called Revolutionize. And they are exactly, they share the same philosophies of working out as mm -hmm. I do. So we combined our um, businesses together, and now I have this uh, consulting firm. It's a nutrition and um, personal one-on-one -on -one training. Oh, cool. Uh, it could do Skype. It could do um, phone calls. It could do anything. So it's, it's completely national. Mm -hmm. um, around the world, I don't care. <laughs> um, but uh, it's, it's, I'm really, really excited about it, and I love these people that I'm working with right now. Well, so it's called Revolutionize. Revolutionize. Well, yes. thank you for joining us. And Thank good you luck for having if me. If there is another season, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready for it though. I really yeah. am. Like I really, 
you know, I feel like the first the first season, um, a lot of things went wrong. It and was I, an indoctrination. I'm, I'm, into yeah, the I'm a lot wiser, and so is my husband. Right. So I think we'll we'll do okay. Amber's got a game face on. For <laughs> yes. more on Amber Marchese and the rest of the Real Housewives of New Jersey, go to foxforum1.com. Thank you.